Giants forward Jeremy Cameron has emerged as a boom trade target for the Power and Crows. The 21-year-old is contract until the end of next year but has strong links to South Australia as the Giants face an uphill battle to hold on to their raft of young stars. He may have only played 51 games, but Jeremy Cameron is already one of the hottest prospects in the AFL. He grew up in the tiny Victorian town of Dartmoor, but Nine News has been told he has strong links across the border in Mount Gambier, is open to playing in Adelaide and is becoming increasingly homesick living in Sydney. The Giants will back themselves to convince Cameron to stay beyond next season, but his mindset is likely to spark a giant bidding war involving the Crows and Power as well as a host of Victorian clubs. Of more immediate concern is the fitness of veteran midfielder Scott Thompson, who looks like he's overcome his back and hamstring concerns for Sunday's match against Collingwood. He's just ticking the boxes at this stage and he'll be assessed later in the week to, to see if he's right, but I'm, you know, hopefully he'll play. David McKay is also set to resume while Patrick Dangerfield trained with a heavily strapped leg, but, as always, is tipped to front. The crunch twilight game looming as a mini-final. Yeah, well, it starts to get that way, doesn't it? We need to find better form, we need individuals to be playing better footy and we need to be playing better collectively. So. Yeah, 8-8 eight and, eight and under no illusion that we need to keep winning to play finals footy. And Port veteran Kane Corns has confirmed he'll be playing on for one more season. The 285 game veteran now destined to be the Power's first to 300. As you get older it does get a little bit more difficult but there's been nothing to indicate to me that, that I can't compete at the level and as, as soon as that does happen I'll probably like Don be the first to put my hand up. Tom Wren, Nine News.